Black Bear's got a new drink time with the most recent update, but getting them to actually show up during that drink time is going to take a little bit of effort. Now, if you saw the live stream where Jaxie explained it, or if you already know this, this isn't going to be some advanced strategy or anything like that. It's just simply explaining the basics, more so for those that don't know what happened or how to get their bears to show up in the new daylight 4 to 8 a.m. drink time. So the first step is actually going to be set it to the old black bear drink time. The full time is from 20 hundred hours to midnight. Bears are notorious for showing up late to their zones, especially if you've been grinding them. So what we're going to do is actually set it to 2300. We'll just do 2312 because why not? And go into the old time. So all your bears that are on your map, you did not get a pop reset. All your bears are going to continue to use the old zones until you actually take them out. So we're going to go to pretty much all the spots that we primarily were grinding for our great one and do that. So looking like we've got three male black bears out here. This one's actually in his drink zone. The other two, at least at the moment, are in the zones. They don't need to be though. All we have to do is actually take the bears out. So we'll use the new 300. I don't have a night vision scope or anything like that. I don't think we'll need it. That should bring that guy down. The other two are far enough away. They aren't going to hear that shot. And I want to make sure we can spot them both and get them both. Because ideally we do this in the least amount of runs possible. Bears will sometimes be really late showing up to the zones. And you may have to do this a couple of times. So probably we'll revisit this zone at some point And see if there's anything still drinking at the nighttime drink slot. Now as for claiming them, I have no idea if that's actually necessary. But... I would probably just err on the side of caution and be sure to pick everything up. I wouldn't want to break something. It's a kind of, I would say, very new thing. Having a new drink time but no pop reset. So at least for me, I'm going to claim everything to make sure we don't somehow introduce some kind of bug where no bears show up. Now, if you're just a casual player who wants to find black bears during the daylight, you can pretty much shoot any bear you want during this nighttime drink zone so they come back in the daylight. If you're great one grinding specifically, I would probably only go to your grinding zones, the ones that you primarily focus on to do this. In theory, that'll actually help you because then you don't have to worry about bears showing up in the daylight that you don't want to shoot. So we're going to go around to all of our spots where we were grinding for a great one, do this, and then come back in the daylight. So like for instance here, we've got a female black bear running along. I'm not going to shoot that. And we should only end up ever encountering this one if we come back during the nighttime drink zones. Now. There's maybe a chance that I'll mess with things. It may be the case that down the road, we do want to go back and shoot the female ones as well. But for now, in the interest of basically just getting the male bears that we're actually interested in hunting to show up during the daylight, we're going to shoot those and leave the females that, so that let's say here in the reeds, there's a bear that we can't spot. We're in that daylight drink zone and I just want to go ahead and take it out. I know because it should be drinking there and that we've not shot a female. It has to be a male bear that's shown up because the females won't be there during that time. So we've gone through all of our spots. Revisiting this first lake, I don't see any bears. I still would recommend going back through your spots probably a second time, at least at some point. But at least recently here, we've killed, looks like about 10 black bears. There's definitely a bunch more we need to go and find. But what we'll now do is reset the time to the new drink time. So it's 4 to 8 a.m. I want to make it daylight. We'll go right in the center and make it about 6 a.m. And the last thing we're going to do is just exit out to the main menu. This seems to help with spawns kind of getting into their place. So when we come back in, we should be able to move around to these same drink locations, the same places where our zones are, and find bears now drinking in the daylight. Now there's a bit of a mix here, because elk also drink at this time. I believe it's the exact same time, 4 to 8. But you can see, black bear level 5 drinking there, and we've got the new zone added on the map. If we zoom in, we can now see black bear there. It still shows the old time too. But you've got that 4 a.m. to 8 a.m. time. If I move my cursor over there, it'll just go away, so I'll just zoom in on it. But that is exactly what we need to do. Kill all the bears at the other locations, come back, got a couple of bears with their new drink zone. So it's pretty darn cool. It'll be nice to actually see black bears in the daylight again. It's something I've missed. I really do like black bears in this game, and when they added the nighttime drink zones, it kind of took away from some of the experience of hunting them. Very much looking forward to future hunts and finding them in at least larger numbers than we really ever did, minus grinding. But it really is as simple as that, and I just wanted to go over everything in case anyone is confused or perhaps wondering why their bears stop showing up after one run. 
obviously if you're continuing at the old drink time the bears are just not going to be going there anymore so hopefully this can help you out i'm actually recording this prior to the live streams or anything this weekend for early access so we'll be doing some more bear grinding just to kind of test out the 300 and stuff like that if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments below and hopefully as we learn more if there is any concerns or any kind of confusion we can clear that up with the comments but anyway that's gonna do it for this short video so as always thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next time